Hello, and thanks for checking out ChartGuys.com. We're proud to be one of the most successful technical analysis communities online, teaching you the skills to become a more confident, effective, and informed trader. Join our community of hundreds of analysts worldwide working together to learn the charts, generate profit, and achieve financial independence. Sign up for a one-week free trial, no credit card required, for access to daily live chart analysis and market coverage, a thriving chat community, along with dozens of hours of exclusive educational materials. We look forward to seeing you. Let's check out some charts. Hey guys, it's James with The Chart Guys. It is Wednesday, January 31st. Gonna do my nightly video on natural gas. So yesterday in the video, I mentioned that there was a bullish reversal candle here happening. And what I would watch for is a break of the low today, uh, which was at 3.161. That was a signal for a bear entry. You can clearly see the increasing bear volume um, confirming that bearish reversal candlestick. Uh, and you can see that we broke the consolidation low here of 3.024 another signal to go short um, and now we are coming up on the next support here at 2.905 that was the, the another support here well we're going to see 2.907 support first but that's pretty close enough where i would say that the, that's the next support line here so you could draw a line straight across the bottom of these two candlesticks here and that is the next support to be watching and you can clearly see that there is increasing bear volume uh, as far as the weekly goes, weekly forming a bearish reversal candlestick here. Uh, lots of upper wick of profit taking. Um, and again, this weekly candlesticks, you see every consecutive candle has had a higher low on every weekly candle. So if we break this low here of 2.907, uh, which is basically that that next the next daily support that I was highlighting. If we break that 2.907 on the weekly, that's going to be a lower low on the weekly, showing me that this is um, that this uh, bounce has potentially come to a halt, and we will reverse the other way again on this weekly chart. Hourly, we are oversold on the hourly, um, so expecting some short-term oversold bounce here in the near future, potentially overnight. And what you can look for on oversold bounce is we have the high here, we have a dump, lower low, lower high on the bounce, another dump, lower high on the bounce, another lower lows. So first resistance to look at on any hourly uh, reversal and any type of oversold bounce is we need to look at this resistance here at 3.002 and $3, after $3 psychological and then um, next resistance is 3.078. If we're looking at the four-hour chart. Doesn't look very good for the bear, uh, for the bulls here. Uh, every four-hour candle, lower low on the four-hour candle. So, uh, if you want to see a reversal, I need to see a higher, uh, a higher high candle on the four-hour chart. So, um, so we'll see if we form a higher low four-hour candle here potentially inside candle and if we're able to break this high here of 3.002 again that lines up with that hourly resistance that I highlighted here the first hourly resistance here at 3.002 if we break that that could be a trend change in the shorter term but definitely not liking the prospects of the weekly showing a big rejection of upper wick and if again if we break this low here of 2.907 um, that changes the weekly in favor of the bull, uh, the bears again. So definitely need to be cautious as a bull in that gas. And bears are definitely liking this increasing bear volume here um, after that bearish reversal candlestick. I want to see what it looks like without the adjusted contract chart. Anyways, this gap down is due to the contract change. Um, so same thing. Definitely have a bearish reversal candle and then increasing bear volume. So if we break the low of today of two point, I'm just gonna go back to the contract change chart, make it simpler. So we break the low of today of 2.949, I'm gonna expect further continuation of downside and see another red daily candle here um, until the potentially if the bear volume dries up, uh, we'll see if we continue to get increasing bear volume or if bears start to get tired, we'll see how much of a dump we have, um, but this chart right now, as of now, is starting to begin to favor the bears in that gas. Have a good night, and I'll see you tomorrow. We'll see what the reaction to the natural gas inventory reports brings us tomorrow. Bye-bye.